I'm taking you to the Swift stand. And new this year is the Swift Voyager. Correct. Yeah, they've only got two models here. They've got the 584 and the 594. They've got two 594s here, which is strange. Yeah, but there's also four models in the Swift Voyager range. You've got the 540, the 564, the 584, and the 594. Starting from 66 all the way up to so about what, 68. So we've got, so we've got the, six four, the 540, which is the drop down front bed lounge. 540 is a front double drop down bed. It's yep. seven meters long. All yep. these vans are also three and a half thousand kilograms. Yes, and then you've got the 594, which is island bed. You'll have the 58. 584, which is a twin singles. Twin singles or transverse. And then you'll have the French bed, which would be the And five the 564 is a real double, but the front also oh, makes up to a double. Don't need that little book. <laughs> right, so which one do you want to have a look at? Do you want to look at the 594? Yeah, island bed. We always like an island bed, don't we? Should we have a quick look? Yeah. See if this 584 is for you. So your 584 is rear singles or transverse? Yeah. So 67 half grand it's shown here. What does your price age do have interest? 67 and a half. Okay, so that's right. Yeah. So twin singles, you get the big garage. Yeah, it's 7.85 metres long. And a full then... berth, full belted seat. Um, yeah, I haven't got what I was looking for on this, but yes. And we're on the Ford. Are you ready? Okay, I'm ready. I'm so ready. So we've got front lounge. With pop-up seats, nice high ceiling. That is a high ceiling, isn't it? Hi. That is. Yes. I'm getting brightness. Yeah, the very, very white. Antarctic white. Probably similar to what some of the Hadrias are, actually. It isn't it? Yeah, In terms it, of the white. Do you know what you're getting? You're thing. getting that continental feel. Hmm. And then we're coming along here. Centre kitchen, three burner hob. Hot plate, standard. The only criticism, that's a very slim fridge. Slim. Pre-COVID weight, that is. All right, Austin Powers. Workout fridge. Um, okay, now moving on to the, let's have a look in here. So what would you say this competes with, Jason? What does it what? Compete with. Hadria. Port Sleeper F-Line. Ultra Trail F line, sorry, Ultra Sleeper. Oh, the F, -line, F series. You're on about the F yeah. series, aren't you? Yeah. F lines. Yeah. With the which are also on the Ford, about a similar sort of price. It's quite a nice feel to it, though, isn't it? Hmm. Really nice feel. And then we're going for the marbly type shower. Well, that's better. Yeah. And then opposite that, you've got the. I'm starting to love Shane. I'm starting the campaign off. Small sinks and bathrooms. Uh, See, I don't mind this too much with a small sink here because what I don't like about a small sink is when you put your hands under the tap and it just goes all the way outside the sink. Right. Does that make sense? I understand what you mean. Because sometimes you turn the tap on, you put your hands like that and the water just goes and the sink's that big and it just goes all the way over there, uh, far from the sink. No, I'm happy that, that that's But I think that's, right size. I think that's big enough and right also size. you've got a bit of side so you're not getting your feet wet. But I've got Crocs on so it doesn't really matter, I've got waterproof Crocs on. It doesn't feel like a Swift, does it? Probably not, but we haven't really seen what the new Swifts look like. Okay. So I've got an idea. I want to just have a quick look at the Island Bed Swift as well. The 594. So let's pop over and have a quick look at the 594. So it does look like they have only got two voyages here as well. So the 584 and the 594. So the 594 7.85 metres long. Um, as I said, I don't know if I mentioned it, it's all three and a half thousand kilograms. I was trying to get some lights on. Again, oh there's much lights on in here, let's have a look. And then we've got the little battery flat. All right, we'll quickly... So same front diner, and the only difference is if you pop up there, Finn, to the other end, you've got a, an island bed. So we've got the island bed. Same bathroom as the other one we just looked at. Ta -da! <laughs> Would you prefer this one or the singles? I'm a single bed person, as you can join them in the middle. Me I'll be Vic, honest. Me and Vic on one side, dog in the middle. 
I'm preferring the 584 to the 594 with the singles. I yeah. don't know, don't ask me why. I just think the other one's got a better feel to it. I'm, I'm this is feeling a bit cold. I'm tempted to say that this is probably a smaller lounge. Because yeah, it's obviously. A bit tighter. It does, don't it? But I think an island bed will probably take a bit more space up. Good point. Good Possibly. Point. I might be making stuff up there, but. I'd They're both the same length, 7.85 metres long. But it just might have rearranged the space inside. Yeah. The 584 is going to cost you 500 quid less. Hmm. And then let's look at the cab. Good looking cab. Yeah. As you can see, this one's on a manual. But yeah, really nice looking cab. Uh, what does the Swift Voyager replace? It doesn't. It's just a new yeah, line. It's a new range with the Ascari yeah. and the... So they're calling it the 500 series, aren't they? Yeah. Basically. And then we've got the other two new models, which is the Ascari and the... Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Are they okay? There's the Voyager Rain. Let's move on. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. The Ascari and the... Do I see the one? No, no, no. We can't finish there. Carrera. Carrera, there we go. Three new Rangers, this is the first one released though. Okay. Who doesn't love a Contiki? See, these are redesigned for 2022, 23, what do you want to call it? And this is the Contiki 794. If you'll notice, it's single axle because they replaced the Contiki Sport with this Contiki. So this used to be uh, a better car, 599 and so on. Full berth, full belted seats, and it's going to start from 91k. Yeah. Which they have gone up in price, but if you have a look, well, let's have a look, a quick look. Bearing in mind it's an island bed. Yeah. Is that adjustable? I would have thought so. Right, now let's have a look inside. So, first thing you right, get. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, oh, hang on, just, hang just on. on. Just hang on a minute. What's the difference between this and the Voyager we've just been in? What is the difference? About 20 grand. And yeah, I know it's 20 grand. But the layout's the same. You're getting posher seats, yeah, but it's still a Voyager. No. Isn't it? No. No? It's a lot Come nicer. In what way? They'll feel this leather, for one. Okay, I'll give you one. <laughs> Another one? You've got surrounds like these. Okay. You've got okay. a more curved cupboard. The with, a with a gloss and matte finish. Okay. Better closing doors. You've also got bits like that on the right there that say Contiki. You've got the honeycomb effect above the door with the Swift Command panel. Okay, which is only, so we're on, which now is only the, on the premium right. no terms. Right, we're now in the Contiki. Now, I did show you the Voyager before, and you can see the total difference between the Contiki and the Voyager. You're getting a lot better upholstery, you're getting the better cupboard. What do you think, Shane? You're getting a more of a better spec on. Yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah. Yeah. It's also on the Fiat instead of the Ford, which is a little bit more expensive. That is the new Series 8 Fiat, which is now a 2.2, not a 2.3. And has that got a digital dash there, Finn? I can't quite see from here. Yeah. Yeah, so you've got the option of a digital dash. I'll tell you what I'm getting. Take a look at the bedroom. I'm getting a sexy bedroom. I'm going to say it. I'm, I'm going to be con controversial. It Take a look at that bedroom. It can't be. I'm not in there yet. Is that a sexy bedroom? That's a nice, nice bedroom. And, and again, I'm... we're getting that centre toilet, and yeah. which is not really bad then, because obviously if you're sleeping in here, obviously sleeping at the back, then you're not intruding in one of the spaces, are you? To go to the toilet. So it's, and so it's the same sort of layout as a five nine four and six nine four. Yeah. Six nine four and so yeah. on. But it's just you've just got a much more premium motor, which you'd expect for ninety old grand. Was that a nice bath uh, bedroom, then? Very nice. Is that a sexy bedroom? Is there anything? Yeah, it is. You even get things like this, look. Ah. I oh. can't quite reach it because there's a table in the way. But basically, it's an electric blind. By the way, oh, I don't fancy it today. But yeah, it's got an electric blind to it as well, which is a really nice feature on something like this. So, <laughs> this was previously the Contiki Sport. They've yeah. renamed the model number and, yeah. the, and the model itself. Cooker's definitely, isn't it? On the top. The, cook, the cooker's getting like a barbecue type of feel to it. And Do you know what you, I mean? And what I love about Swifts with these, if you put that down, yeah. it's a click into place and it won't rattle. I get the gist. Yeah, you Shane. get the gist. I get the gist. Rather than just a glass top. Okay, okay. Is it worth 90k? 
Well, if your hammer was worth 212, you can, buy, you, can buy two, you can buy two of these and still have change for your holidays, for booking campsites for two years. And something, it's a bit of a bad lighting on this one. Let's go to... Let's go Are to you on a boat? No, 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 come over here, come over here. Similar to the Swift Escapes and everything like that, I really like that style there. What, the decals? Yeah. OK. And you can't quite see it as well as much on this because there's an overshadow. But when you normally look at that, it looks like there's a vent there. But it's just a decal. If you took away the shadow from the awning, it looks really good. There's no vent there. I know there isn't. But they've done a decal to look like a vent. You know about that? Oh, this bit here, look. That bit. Optical illusion. Yeah, optical illusion. Looks like Hammer's lost his youth, Finn. Right, okay, look at that one over there, look. Yeah? Doesn't that look like a vent above the cab? No. Underleaf, too late. No. Oh, well, don't spoil it for me. Looks nothing like a vent. That one, if you look at that one, that's, that's right. You know, you know, know what it is? You know what it is? You know, when you see clouds, right, I think clouds look like a certain shape. You look at things that look like a totally different shape. And that does not look like a vent. Anyway, Swift Contiki, let's move on. <laughs>